Boom dia, good afternoon, good evening guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this YouTube video. Welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel for the newcomers. My name is Didi Tayuhutu. Yes, I'm from Bitcoin Generation X. I'm mined on the 26th of May in 78 and I haul my Bitcoins and I drink yellow juice because it's the color of Bitcoin. Hmm. Good morning guys. Cloudy days. But the only thing I know for sure is, after the clouds disappear, the sun will shine. And we need to have some sunny days in this Bitcoin bull run. I'm going to show you a chart that shows you how many sunny days we had and how many sunny days we will have before we head to the end of that huge top in this bull run. Really cool charts. Four other really, really awesome charts. I discovered them on Twitter. You need to see this video completely till the end. You wanna, don't want to miss one of these charts, guys. Please, trust me. I'm from Bitcoin Generation X. I don't lie. <laughs> Check these charts till the end, guys. Amazing charts. Let's quickly jump into the charts because we don't want to talk too much, Diddy, because then the video will become too long again. And back. This is the first chart, guys. Uh, as you used, I start on the four hour chart. On this four hour chart, um, we see that, yes, we have a low over here. We created a higher low, but now at the moment, Bitcoin price is dumping. Bam, it went all the way to 32,200. I want the Bitcoin body of this candle close above this line. If we close above this line, I'm still feeling very secure. If we don't close above, above this line, we could drop further into this green box. Um, we, of course, want to make sure that we are going to go above the right li red line again, but that can take some time. Let's jump into this chart to see, show you even more what I mean. Bam, here. Because this chart is a one-day chart. We are zooming out slowly. And on this chart, I drew this uh, three yellow lines, like three days ago, four days ago in a video. And in those uh, three yellow lines, you can see exactly what I thought that could happen. You had three scenarios. We were going up, bam, or this one, bam, or this one, bam. All three of the scenarios need to break that yellow line. This is the yellow line that if we break it, that is for me the moment I turn really bullish again. Because every time in history, we do the same. We can draw that yellow line if we have this huge dip. And then when we break that yellow line, we go up again. Here again, a huge dip. This correction is red one. If we break that line, we go up again. Every time we do that, even if we draw it over there, we could even draw it here, huge dip. And then when you break that line, you go up again. Here, we had that huge dip. These are the two top points that we took the line from. Huge dip. Now we need to break that line to go further up again. That would be 48 or here 44 or here 42,000. So as it seems, we were going down first here and then we will go up again. So I expect some more sideways movement in this chart. This here over there, that is the death cross that everybody was talking about. But like you can see, the death cross was already the dip here that created the death cross. And now we will go sideways and go up because that mostly happens after a death cross. Like if you can see here, this is the huge dip. And then the dead cross was over there a few days later. So the dip happened before the dead cross. When the dead cross happened over there, why am you not drawing, Didi? Because people won't understand again. You need to be a little bit better, eh? So the dead cross happened over there, and the dip was already there. When the dead cross happened, the price was already going up. Same here, the dip is over there, the dead cross happens over there. And when the dead cross happened, the price was already going up. That is why I drew that green line. If the price keeps going up, we are on track if it does uh, up to the dead cross. Let's jump into the next chart. Like, now you can see it better clear. My Didi, why don't you zoom in? Uh, next chart, guys. Bam! This is the chart that uh, I've been sharing with you also already for weeks. I told you guys, on the 25th of the month, the last Friday of the month, we mostly dip and we mostly dip. We have dipped the last seven times. This would be the dip again, for example, on the 25th or 26th of June. Are we doing this again? Because the price is going down. This Friday will be 
that last Friday of the month. To be exactly, I need to check my agenda, it will be the 25th. So will we again up the last Friday, the 25th, dip to a bottom? Let's see. Then this chart is perfect. Then we know this again for the next next month. Again, a dip on the 25th probably. Let's jump into this chart. Man, God, what a many charts. This is the week chart. Yes, zooming out like I drew this chart yesterday. Top over there, the yellow circle. Here is a top. There. Here we have a top over there. Here we should have a top over there. And why we will have this top over there? That is the second part of the video. That is the part where I'm going to show you charts that will look, blow you away. You will want to see all of these charts, guys. In between a commercial, <laughs> if you want to trade all of this, please go to our YouTube channel. You type YouTube or you're watching YouTube at the moment, probably. You go to our channel and in the channel, please, down below the videos, Wow, 11k views beautiful video yesterday down below the videos i will put in the comment in the first comment that will be pinned you will see the special offer bonuses so you can claim two two thousand six hundred ten dollar us dollar ten dollar us dollar diddy come on and take some drinks hmm. in bybit exchange um if you click that link then you get the bybit bonus Prime XBT, you get a 50% bonus. Machina Trader, make sure you sign up to that one because we are going to use it in the future. Aurox also, make sure you sign up today. That's the only thing I can say. Make sure you sign up today. That's the only thing I buy a bit. Uh, Dudex, $300 bonus, guys. And even if you want to use Binance, please um, sign up to this one. That was all the commercial time. Ding, dong, dong, dong. We will go <laughs> back to the charts, guys. Oh my God, that's Monday morning. Let's jump into the next charts, the very cool charts, the amazing charts. This is the first one. I need to ch check first if my face is okay. No, my face is not okay. Make it smaller, my face, and put it over there. This is the first chart. Guys, this is awesome. If you look at 2011, 13, 17, and 2021, we can draw these trend lines. And these trend lines become the bottom of... Um, of the run so the, the, the this line the dotted lines this line we touched that line a few times this line we touched that line this time our line in 2021 we touched that line and now we should going up and maybe touch the line again and going up it depends on how uh, that the chart will evolve but this chart is showing you that there is a trend in the lines and i'm going to show you even more trend lines that are going to show you even more clear why so please stay and watch the rest of the video you want to see these charts give this video already a thumbs up now please give it a thumbs up you need to give it a thumbs up okay let's jump into the next chart that is what this chart is going to tell you also a really cool chart that i need to put my face against somewhere else over there for example i keep dragging my face all over the place um but this chart is showing you why pi everybody's always talking about pi pi is an important number and why is pi an important number hmm. because check we have the top over there when we go no i need to draw we are going to start here when we take the top of that year and we do that top times 1.6 we get the moment that bitcoin pulls back there before the huge run did you see that okay let's do it again when we have the top of the bull run and 1.618 level above that top is the moment if Bitcoin pulls back and finds support we will go up again do you see that same over there now we do it again when we have that level of the top 20k times 1.6 we come in an area where we will find support over there and if we find support, we will continue that bull run all the way up. If this chart is not clear, then I don't know anymore. Every cycle the same. And now you understand why the Fibonacci and the Pi uh, number are all that important. Fibonacci retracement levels. Because these numbers show mathematically <laughs> in history that they have been have an importance of everything in life even the patterns in your arm or flowers or whatever this is 
this shot was uh, sh uh, was shared with me by someone I forgot the name on Twitter she sent me the beautiful picture as well with the arm is also like 1.6 1 1.6 1 1.6 really cool how this net works but you watch a documentary on that on on, on Pi and on and Fibonacci but this is what I'm seeing 1.6 is the support level before the run 1.6 support level before the run 1.6 support level before the run also telling you amazing buying opportunity let's go to the last few charts keep on hanging in because it's getting more exciting bam you want to see this one as well oh my god did he breathe breathe you're talking so much yes i know um this chart was uh, created by uh, the rational the rational root uh, sorry oh, let's do that without uh, burping hmm. this chart is shown by the rational root um, I, I, I needed to understand what he was saying, but I did understand now what he said because he's saying um, the bullish days of Bitcoin, like a summer, you have like 30 days of uh, summer days in the, in, in the year, you know, and, and the rest of the year is not summer. And he compared it like that. And he's like, if we have bullish days, like we have summer days in summer, we have bullish days in the bull run, uh, we would be now exactly at this point over there. And the red line is 2021. And then he uh, analyzed, okay, if I take uh, the previous all-time high and then the amount of summer days from the period of time till that point, so that would be 28 summer days till now, 28 Bitcoin bullish days, we would be here. And that is how we drew these lines in 2011, in 2013, and in 2017. And by drawing the lines in the same system, he saw that the line was kind of a bottom and from that bottom point on the line is going up from that bottom point on the line is going up and at the end even overperforming the line like 2013 you can see that is that bottom point and then the line is go oh no that's the wrong line and then the line oh that's also the wrong line and then the line is going up so i don't know why it's sometimes thin and sometimes thick so 2017 and then the bottom point and then you know bam and then at the end if you're going up so is this now the price floor this red line of 2021 which would mean that from here we would not do that but from here we would go slowly up like that slowly up slowly up slowly up and then at the end the line and then maybe something like that that could be and that would be a 400 percent uh, from that moment on so that's really amazing and um, that would also say and be in line with all the other prizes and which prizes bam this is the first one if we would continue then after 50 summer days around 50 summer days that's not like the every day is only the bullish days we would get a price level of 142k and if we would even continue longer bam then we would even go to the top of 392k if it is up to this price model guys do i have even more awesome charts yes i have only one more chart oh my god 17 minutes already bam this is really the last chart also here in the top on the right the rational route go follow him on twitter because i always uh, you know give the people credit that trade these charts this chart is also a very cool chart i will last chart i have today guys and um, also look this is the thermal cap the blue line the yellow line is of course the price and you can see that every time in the bottom when we come into this green square over there that is the moment you need to look at here green square over there that's the moment you need to look at over there here in this green square that's the moment you need to look at because why do you need to look at that line every time we come in this box and when we go out we have the huge bull run we are just entering that box we are still high in the box so yes that can come down a little bit more but in the end if we would copy the cycle look up down up down up down if we would do that guys this would be the cycle this would be the cycle and that would put us somewhere over here that would be somewhere in december of this year so i can't say anything more about all these charts only thing that i can say is bam these charts show me sorry that it's taking so long it's almost 20 minute video but the charts show me that we are exactly at that perfect buying moment in bitcoin again yes we already were at 60 yes we are now back at 30 
these are the depths you have been screaming for. These are the depths you have been wishing for. These are the depths you have been dreaming of. And don't please think now that Bitcoin will go to 20K or 10K and that you can buy that dip. I don't see this happening. If I were you and you had that small doubt, then I would dollar cost average into Bitcoin now. Buy a little bit at 30. If it dips more, buy a little bit more and more. If it goes to 35, buy a little bit more because we will go to 100K in my opinion. But that's my opinion. My Bitcoin generation X, generation X opinion. That was everything for today, guys. I hope you really enjoyed this information, this video. If you did enjoy the video, give the video a thumbs up. Share it with your friends and family. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. And please leave a comment. What do you think about these charts, about this video, about my t-shirt, about my cap, about the cloudy days, and about the sun that is going to shine tomorrow again and yes let me know if you think that bitcoin will dip again on the 25th thanks for watching and see you later today or tomorrow again Bam!